Wow! City Gospel Church has been around for three years now. I remember three years ago when we just spent our Sunday activities in our humble abode. It was all we had at that time. There, we held our simple prayer sessions, Bible studies, worship, and fellowship. Gospel Church was born out of unplanned circumstances. But we believe that those circumstances were not accidents. They were all orchestrated by our good and great God. Because from the very beginning, we witnessed His goodness and faithfulness to this church. Pastor Bo and I were Christians since early 90s and we were friends. Pastor John Seya ordained both of us as the pastors of City Gospel Church. Then from our home, the Lord moved us to a new worship place. It was great and we were settling in nicely until suddenly the pandemic struck. China has identified the cause of the mysterious new virus. Coronavirus. Coronavirus. There are fears a rapidly spreading virus has reached Australia. This is a rapidly emerging situation. And so for two years, just like the other churches, we conducted our church services via online Zoom meeting so that we could all stay strong and encourage one another. But during those times, we started to pray that the Lord will give us a new place, a place that we will no longer pay rent, and we can call it as our own. And there it is, a new place was given to us by God. With much excitement, Pastor Lito designed the new church. And then construction began. After several months, the church was finally finished. From there, we started recording videos to post. And by the grace of God, the pandemic began to subside, letting us have our first face-to-face -face service in our newly built church. Nung uh, nagkaroon kami ng malalim na pag-uusap with Pastor John Seya and uh, napag-usapan namin about uh, deeper truths sa Bible tungkol sa gospel and kingdom of God at uh, hanggang sa dumating sa point na nag-decide kami na mag-isawa to start a church under City Gospel Church. Together with uh, Pastor Bong and Pastor Lito, uh, na-provide yung mga kailangan para maumpisaan yung church sa Kalamba. And then, uh, kahit maliit, nagpisa kami sa garage, ito sa garahe ng aking pamangkin na si Kim anak ng aking kapatid na si Venus at doon nagumpisa ang uh, City Gospel Church, Kalamba then the Lord uh, opens a blessings from garage nakatransfer kami sa crossing, Kalamba in a commercial building Sa ngayon, uh, we have an outreach sa aming bayan sa Louisiana, sa San Buenaventura, uh, under City Gospel Church. At ongoing ngayon yung maliit na chapel na ginagawa doon. Sa ngayon, uh, uh, nagbukas din ng isang maliit na Bible study sa Barangay Gulod, Kabuyaw, Laguna. At dito ko nakikita na yung vision na ibinigay ni Lord para sa City Gospel Church na mag-multiply and yung thing nagmamaterialize with the addition ng mga kapatid na natagpuan sa iba't ibang lugar. Kaya I believe na itong pinagagawa ni Lord, ito yung kalooban niya sa amin para magpatuloy sa City Gospel Church. So, 
I know na maraming pang gagawin ang Panginoon sa bawat isa kaya we continue to serve our Lord under the city The church vision is based on sharing the love and the gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ. Our mission is to make disciples who will be Christ-like in character, which the main purpose of our life is to be conformed into the image of His Son Jesus Christ. By the grace of God, we have noticed that the Lord is bringing more souls here in CGC and our church might no longer be able to accommodate it in the near future. And so we realized the need for a bigger worship place. So we kneeled down and prayed again to the Lord. The Lord's hands began to work in ways we did not expect. A miracle happened, and it's overwhelming. Truly, God is faithful. The Lord answered our prayers. Now we have our future church location. All of this would have not been possible without the help and grace of our Almighty God. And so my brothers and sisters, as we grow together in faith, in character, and in numbers, let us love God above all, and let's love one another as Christ loves us.